In NukeX, we are introducing the Grid Warp Tracker node, which is a new tool for helping to create match moves, tracker warps, and morphs. This node solves the manual tracking you previously had to do utilizing the planar tracker, which would constrain you to rigid transformations. Now you can warp across custom defined grid shapes and have tracking data driven by the power of smart vectors without having to worry about micro distortions that could occur on long shots with a purely smart vector workflow. When using the grid warp tracker, you have two grids to work with, the from grid and the to grid. First, we're going to select our from grid and draw a grid over the area of the element we want to warp. Once we have the adjusted grid into place, we can simply hit the track icon on the top of our viewer to create our tracked grid. I'm just going to jump forward a bit as we already know what tracking looks like. Now you can see that we have our from grid shape being driven by our smart vectors, but our to grid is still in its default position. So now we can either copy the data from our from grid to our to grid or simply click the link icon to connect them. Now our to grid is also being driven by the tracking data. I'm now going to add a third grid, which will be our adjustment grid. We could simply do this work directly on the to grid, but I prefer to use an adjustment grid to help keep the workflow flexible. And this means I only have to make my warp adjustments on a single frame to see them propagated across the rest of the shop. The purpose of providing users with multiple grids to work with is to ensure that you have control and flexibility over how you work with your data. So that if you want to retest or make amendments without losing your original data, you can do so without having to create a backup version of the node. The great thing about this workflow is that if there's anything that I want to fine tune or adjust across the shop, then on that frame, I can simply add another key and position the grid warp as needed. 